Today at the ranch what we're kind of wanting to do is give you a little bit of background and, and teach you some things and let you learn some things about agriculture, okay? Hey partner, how you doing? <laughs> For over 30 years, the third grade classes of Pioneer Elementary in Weezer, Idaho have made the annual trek to the Chandler Valley Ranch to touch, smell, and see agriculture. It's a good time to see if you're smarter than a third grader when it comes to farm life. So how many pounds of food does a cow eat in a day? Yes? 15. 15. 10. 10. 6. 6. 100. 100 pounds? 55. 55. 55 pounds of food a day. What's the first thing you have to do to be able to get a field of wheat? You first have to plant the seeds. First you have to plant the seeds. Very good. Cody Chandler manages the cattle herd on the ranch and while horseback talk to the kids about ranch life. The spur isn't just to kick the horse. If I want the horse to back up, I use my spur to tell him to back up. See? See? So, no matter what I want the horse to do, that's how I communicate to him. Because he doesn't speak English. Okay, let's go over here and we're going to talk about Maggie. Maggie is a milkable plastic Holstein cow that travels the state in the Farm Bureau Mobile Agricultural Classroom and it's the main attraction of kids. So they love Maggie, that, uh, hands down they really do. So have you got any milk in that yet? Uh, Alice Chandler, Vice Chair of the Farm Bureau Women's Leadership Committee, says the Mac trailer offers many hands-on tools that kids enjoy and learn from. I think everything that uh, we have available is important for educating the kids. It's the truck's been, or the trailer's been put together really well to have things that are hands-on and tools to educate. Like the wheat station that concludes with the third graders grinding wheat in the flour. Why are they called bummer lambs? Well, when their moms don't take care of them, lambs have to go to other moms. And the final question? Why are some lambs called bummers? And other moms won't let lambs that aren't their own suck. So the lambs, the bummer lambs, they come up from behind the moms um, to get the milk. And that's why they call, they call them bummer lambs, because they come up to the bum. So, are you smarter than a third grader at the farm? With the Idaho Farm Bureau, the voice of Idaho agriculture, I'm Steve Ritter.